this three-stage two-day race with third and fourth category from all over Wales and the surrounding areas. We've got teams from Bath, teams from Bristol, We've got teams from up north. They're all coming down for this infamous race. Should be a cracker. Congratulations on the win. You came in three seconds ahead of the next ride, the next team, which is on its cycles. Did you expect to win the time trial today? I think our main objective was to try and keep a tight unit on the way out um, and then just squeeze on a little bit in the tailwind on the way back. And that worked out pretty well. Morgan did some really strong turns and kept us together on, on the climbs and we just dosed our effort nicely over the, uh, over the course. Um, I, yeah, I think that we, we had a plan, we stuck to it and it seems to have paid off. Yeah, the, Morgan in particular um, did the biggest turn on, on Crack Hill, which is the, the long climb on the way back. Um, and he really put us, he put us on the rivet, but just enough to just keep us there. Um, and he, yeah, so he deserves the yellow jersey, he was clearly the strongest today. You'll all be riding for him then? We'll do our best. Yeah. We'll do our best to help do that. As long as he promises to pay his share of the prize money to us, then yeah, we will. So I'm here with the yellow jersey, Morgan Hendry from Talbot Wheelers. In his second only road race, he took the yellow home today. So what have you been doing up till now? Been doing time trials. Time trials mostly. Got into that last year. It was two years now, actually. So, yeah, second road race so far. How long have you actually been competing? Oh, for a year, for a year now. But I'm guessing you've been cycling for a lot longer than that, doing club rides and stuff. Yeah, I started off mountain biking a lot, but then a lot of injuries with that, so going to road racing, man. Okay, thank you. Have a good ride this afternoon. Thank you very much. Okay, so we're with the dad and the team manager of the Talbot Wheelers, who took home the yellow today. But obviously, it was a great stage, and. Your son's second only road race? Yeah, his second um, road race competitively, yeah. He's, um, he took, pre took um, part in the um, President's Road Race in the Neath Valley, uh, I think it was last month, yeah. How did he do in that? Yeah, I think he finished 25th or something in that, yeah. Do you think yeah. he's going to be one to watch for the future while he's well, not around to get embarrassed? Well, hopefully, yeah. It's, um, obviously, he's riding well at the moment. He's a strong rider and obviously the team have um, commented on his strengths as well. So. Yeah, he's a team player and uh, he's riding strong at the moment, yeah. What's his ambition like? What do you think will be the next move for him? Well, I'm not sure. He's, he's enjoying what he's doing, time trialling and road racing, and um, we'll just wait and see what... Um, you never know. Someone, obviously a team, will come along and um, pick him up and sort of encourage him on his cycling journey, yeah. Got high hopes for the rest of the race? Hopefully, yeah. yeah I'll see. We'll just see how it goes on the first day. He's in yellow, the team's in uh, behind him, so um, fingers crossed, yeah. Do you think we'll see him in any more races this year? We've got the junior tour coming up. Yeah, we'll wait and see. We'll, we'll get some information today, and um, hopefully someone will approach him and get him involved with that. Yeah, that'd be good. Well, let's hope this form carries on. Thank you very much. Yeah, thanks very much. Bye.